Hey guys, welcome to TCR. Sit here and we're at Shooting Fest. Let's show you what it looks like. Are you excited about your first plane ride? Sure. Yeah? Yeah. Are you nervous? Yeah. You'll be fine. <laughs> Where are we going? Uh, for what? For the TCR. We just got to Catoosa, Oklahoma, which is like from Tulsa. I feel like we've been flying all day. <laughs> it really feels like we've been at an airport or flying or driving or something all day long, which we kind of have. But we just got to our room and uh, we, you know, unpacked our stuff, got it put away. The room is really nice. I'm going to show you guys in a second. Um, we're here a few days early for Shoot Dang Fest. Today is Wednesday. Shoot Dang Fest doesn't actually happen until. Friday, Saturday. Hi. Hi. We got here a little bit early because we have some friends out here that we wanted to see. Then I'm gonna go see Chrissy and Jeremy from Paragon Ridge Ranch tomorrow. Uh, go check out Beeline Feed and go check out their farm and meet all their little furries. I'm gonna poke around and film some and have a good time. So there's gonna be a lot of filming over the next few days. I'll probably go live a few times uh, during Shoot Dang Fest. So if you're seeing this after the fact, go back and check out some of the lives. You'll see a lot of other people from a lot of other channels and then a lot of people that came because they watched the Crockers and they wanted to come and, and see them or maybe see some of the other channels too that are around. Had to get some beer. Had to get the beer because it's beer 30. It's really only two o'clock my time, but I have been up since 12.45 in the morning. So I'm, it's, I don't know what it is right now. It's okay, it's all good. Lay's dill pickle flavored, surprisingly delicious. Mm -hmm. Who knew? 10 so, out of 10. 10 out of 10. So this is the king bed suite. So this is the front door. You walk in here, there's a little Should desk, which, uh, yeah, this is a little desk, which is great because Frankie actually, since I had to pull her out of school for this trip, she's got all her schoolwork she can work on in, in the off time there. It's got a dishwasher, sink, a toaster. I got some cake pans to use to make the, the uh, randomized version of the cowboy caviar slaw, a little hybrid that I'm going to uh, try to work with there and we got our waters in there we're good to go so then you come around here you got your full length mirror so you can wave to everybody when you're holding a camera there we go and then um we've got our our little couch sofa bed thing situation but i think frankie and i are just going to share the king bed because it's pretty big and uh she's going to stay on that side this is my side closer to the bathroom because you know i'm old and uh we tend to have to get up in the middle of the night when we get to be as old as I am. So you got your full bathroom here and then you got your closet and then your bathroom, toilet, shower. So this is a really nice room. The hotel, when we walked in, didn't we? What did we say? Oh my God, it smells so clean. Yeah, we literally walked in through like the side door because of the key card, the online key card. And I was like, it's nice in here. It smells clean. And then we walked in the hotel room. We were like, it's like, fancy. We were like, hmm. Yeah, for, and honestly, because it's what, 109 a night? Yeah. I think I said it was. Now, granted, we did get the group rate for Shoot Dang Fest. Uh, Jason and the gang got everybody that booked under Shoot Dang the group rate. Um, but these rooms are really nice. It's fun. And this is our first real girls trip together, huh, Frank? Uh-huh. Just us girls. Uh-huh. Yeah, no boys allowed. Oh yeah, no boys. It's Friday.
Friday night. Got the table. And we're gonna get dinner. Ding fest and everybody's just kind of getting set up and I'm really tired. We haven't slept in like three days. It's been a long couple of days but we're having fun and seeing some people we haven't seen in a while other than on the YouTube so we're having a good time. What did David give you? Oh did you go say thank you? Yes I did. Oh good job let's see. Oh look at that. Come on. <laughs> oh we're in that in our next video. Probably. Well, not in this video. Well, not That's in this video. This video I'm in. Tim's in the corner again. What'd you oh, do? I'm always in the corner. I'm always in the corner. <laughs> How you doing? We're good. We're good. Uh, where's Michael? He's at home. I know. We miss you, Michael. I know. Yeah, next year, Michael's coming out, right? <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna make him come next. Make year. him come. That's, That's right. Because right. he's got to meet everybody. Gotta hang with the Navy guys. You know? That's ex right. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Frankie, having fun? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. 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 Last time, right? I didn't. No. Happy. <laughs> Got the Crocker corner over here. Jerry's standing off to the side. We got Jason over there. Everybody's. Oh, sorry. Everybody's slinging their gear. We just brought some koozies to hand out to, to people, but. There we go. Dance, monkey, dance! <laughs> Brazo Valley soaps over here. We got Danielle hiding in the corner. If we weren't flying, we would buy some soap. But I think between all the other stuff we got from other YouTubers, we're already tapped on space. But everybody raves about Brazo Valley soaps. There's Irene, Miss Irene right there. I saw Debbie. Oh, there's Mark over there from Grumpy Grandpa Patriot Show way in the back. There's Debbie. Two old people on a couch. Go check out on Mike and Terry here. If I can find them. I see Terry. Oh, there's Mike. There we go. We got Big Mike from MT Homestead. How are you guys doing? What's going on? Oh man, this is great, isn't it? Yeah. You having a yeah. good time? I'm having a great time. Right on, right on. And we're oh Terry just got up and disappeared again. There? Oh, there she is. There's Terry. <laughs> She's in the silent film. She's just <laughs> waving. That's all. <laughs> yeah. Right on. Are you guys having a blast? Are you having fun? Yeah. Yeah. I seen you last night over by yourself texting. Yeah. Yeah. She got a little bit bored last night. Yeah. I mean, not a lot Too of... Too many drunk people. <laughs> not yeah, enough keep kids. Keep that on the film. Right? Yeah. Too many drunk people last night. From the mouths of babes. Right? <laughs> and, but everybody wasn't... I mean, nobody got crazy. I mean, there was full-grown adults playing golf because they got bored and then started doing cartwheels. So... I call that a little crazy, but you know. Alright. Fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Look, we got Judy along with Shannon. Yes. We got Mark. We got the Grandpa oh, Patriot oh, Show. Yep. Oh, don't call us that. <laughs> it's practically a four-letter word. <laughs> 
I got a sticker on my car that says, don't California my Texas. I know, right? <laughs> it's only some of us in California. Not, not all of us, know, right? I mean, most of California's farmland, it's just it's darn LA and San Francisco that gets us in trouble. Actually, it's beautiful. Listen, you get out here and I'll get out the country in any area and they're good people. Country people are good people. Yeah. Any state. Yeah. That's right. Oh, I want to go back. Yeah. So, so Who is this? Your mini me? Oh, yeah, that's my mini me. That's Frankie. Hi. <laughs> Roped into the YouTube world. That's right. Who do we have here? We got full blown country. Hello. Hi, folks. Hi. I'm Sid from TCR. Excuse me? I'm Sid from TCR. TCR. Yeah, well, the crowd full blown country here right from Texas. Yeah, okay. Giving out shirts and hats Look at to you. all those that come and subscribe. Woohoo! Look at that. Yes, ma'am. Right on. So, what's your channel all about? Full blown country. A little bit of everything. <laughs> a little bit of everything. I do. I do a lot of custom shirts. Okay. I do a lot of outdoor stuff, working on vehicles, working the land, fencing, whatever. I'm about three months old, so I'm kind of growing into it. Okay. And finding that right groove, but um, yeah, it's it's a growing. I'll get there. Right on. Y'all subscribe and like. That's right. We'll Leave go me check a it out. That, yes. that way I'll know. Definitely. And I return the favor then. Right on. There we go. Yeah, go check out his channel, guys. Let him know what you think. Please do. Thank you. Oh, fancy stick. Fancy <laughs> that's that's to beat off my assailants. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I got your back. Don't worry about it. I just walk around with you like that. Right. I'll, I'll be your muscle. There we go. Right. And I mean, I believe Frankie could probably take it too. She, yeah, she I probably mean, could. I know that she knows that Tom's food fight. I know she was really mad she couldn't bring her pocket knife on the plane. Yeah. The I struggle is real. It does like that. Yeah. What you do is you go buy your pearl I got a brand new one too. <laughs> they took it? No. Oh no, I, she knew oh. better than to bring it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, we'd still be at the airport like being tackled yeah, right? if she That's brought right. it. Yeah, we'd be in trouble. Nice. <laughs> So right behind me there is Tammy Erin. Uh, she played Pippi Longstocking in the Pippi Longstocking movies, and she came up to me and said, oh, you're from the Crouch Ranch, right? And I was like, yeah? She's like, I saw your video. And I was like, Pippi Longstocking knows who I am. <laughs> so that, was, that kind of made my day. That was cool. <laughs> she just took a picture with us, too. So that's good fun. <laughs> All right, so we were all inside in the little conference room earlier, and I went live for a little while, so you can look back on that video, uh, the live video, and see like some of the people I talked to there or whatever. And Chrissy just got here from Paragon Ridge Ranch, and she's, she's over here right now. She's right behind me. There we go. Yeah. I was trying to make Frankie smile. She's trying to make Frankie smile, but I don't know, right? <laughs> Get so, in here, sister. She's, she's here. She's gonna be here the whole night just by herself because the boys all have to leave because there's a fishing competition. So we we're gonna we might maybe get into some trouble. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe just oh, a little yeah. bit. Just a little trouble, bit. right? Just a little bit. Yeah. Someone tells me that this combination is not good. <laughs> not good. Not good. Uh oh. <laughs> this kid talks like a 35 year old professor. I by the know way. she does. He's so cute. We love him. We love you. We love you. Just got back from shoot dang fest yesterday, which was Sunday, and. Here it is Monday. I am still completely sleep deprived, but I'm not complaining. I We had the best time. Um, big shout out to, of course, Jason and Jared Crocker and Danielle, of course, for getting this organized. Um, it's so great to see everybody. And of course, to Auntie Anne, because she's the one that set it up with the hotel and did a lot of, did a lot of legwork, apparently. So big shout out to those guys for, for getting Shoot Dang Fest to come to fruition because I know when you're setting up something like that, it's not easy. It's it's hard. There's a lot of moving parts and a lot of people and so kudos to them. It was so nice to meet everybody. I got to see some people and talk to some people that I saw last time at the prior meetup but that I didn't get a chance to really talk to. So this time I actually got to talk to them. So that was nice. And I always feel, you know, I get a little bit in my own head, I guess, and always feel like a little bit of an outsider <laughs> just because um, I'm from California, you know, so I let that, you know, kind of get in my brain that, you know, we're kind of the only one from here. And so we don't have the same, we're not able to do the same kind of collaborations and things uh, 
together that some of the channels are able to do, which bums me out because I would love to be able to do more of that. In fact, I got my I got my my earrings I got at Beeline Feed when I went to go see Chrissy from Paragon Ridge Ranch, which I'm wearing. I'm wearing my Paragon Ridge Ranch shirt right now too. Um, we had the best time together. In fact, be on the lookout for that video. I should be posting that this coming Sunday um, of our adventures over at Chrissy's Farm. So I'm excited about that. You know, it was a great time. We did, there was not as much filming taking place. So I didn't have a whole lot of footage. I only ended up going live once while I was there. Um, and for not very long, I think it only went live for like 20 minutes. Yeah, like it was just more of a everybody hanging out, chatting. I watched the video that Danielle and Jason did on uh, Can I Talk in the recap of Shoot Dang Fest and they were saying how it kind of had that backyard barbecue feel to it. And it definitely did. Somebody got a bunch of hot dogs and were doing grilling um, in the afternoon. Uh, we all, a bunch of us went out to dinner on Friday night. I think mainly because a lot of people had been traveling and were tired and nobody really wanted to cook that night. Um, but Saturday night, we did another big dinner and come on homesteading David um, and his son Levi and his buddy, whose name I did not catch, were man in the grill, bought all the stuff, um, put it all together, uh, fed everybody. I went and made a, a cowboy caviar slaw. The hotel was right like next to a Walmart. So I got a big old tray and it had like, you know, different kinds of slaw and stuff in it. And I just whipped that all up together. Um, just basically, if you know what a cowboy caviar is, it's like beans and corn and you put cilantro and purple onion and fresh lime juice and all that. So it was that with like a creamy cilantro avocado dressing and a lot of like shredded cabbage that like you'd get like the, the coleslaw mix with the red cabbage and all of that. And I just, I did the fresh lime squeeze in it and all that. And that seemed to be a, a big hit. So I got something healthy in everybody down there while I was there. Darn it. I was determined, <laughs> you know, so that was easy to whip together in a hotel room and people seemed to like it. So that was good. And I know Jeremy and Chrissy also uh, contributed and, and helped David from Come On Homesteading out a little bit. And, and, uh, cause I witnessed that. So Shout out to them for, for helping to contribute to that too. So that was great. Everybody just kind of banded together and, you know, helped get it done. So it, that was a, that was a fun night. Um, everybody had a good time. You know, when you're at somebody's event like that, you got to make sure you pick up after yourself. And if you see something that's sitting there that shouldn't be sitting there, that you pick it up and throw it away. We don't want people to say, oh my God, those YouTubers are terrible, filthy creatures and they don't clean up after themselves. You don't want that. And you, you don't want it to come back on Jason or Auntie Anne or Jared or anybody whose name is like really attached to the event. But it was a great, it was, it was great. So we, we had a fabulous time. I am glad to be home. I will say that traveling is exhausting. I did not get enough sleep for four days. So I'm definitely going to be playing catch up. Um, you know, this week is going to be Frankie's at sixth grade camp. So it's, there's no kid this week, which means I have extra chores. Mike's going to have extra chores. Um, and we're going to miss her on top of just, it's the house is going to be quiet, like weird quiet without her here. So that's going to be strange. This will be the longest I think we've ever been away from her in like one chunk like that. So it's going to be weird. And especially since I just spent the last four days, like solidly with her, like sleeping with her in the same room and every, and in the same bed, like we shared, you know, we shared the bed at the hotel. So we've just been together, together, together. And then I dropped her off at school this morning and I was like, now I'm not going to see you for a week. This feels weird. Well, five days, not a full week, but it just feels weird to, to do that. But I know she's going to have the best time, so I'm excited. But so to wrap it up, guys, I, you know, we had a great time at Shoot Tank Fest. We had a great time in Oklahoma. It's beautiful. We love it there. We have some great friends there. I think I can say now, um, I can't wait to go back and check out, uh, Chrissy's property via editing Sunday's video. Um, with everything that's in there. So I look forward to that. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell so you get the notifications. We'll see you guys next time.